instead what we write is first we'll write the action what is the action that will do that the stack b comma d will do that and what is the precondition of the stack the first is holding b clear d right this is my precondition so should i write here yes i can write here so in the stack what i have to do i have to erase it right i have to erase it and then i have to write what we have to write the action what is the action stack p comma d holding b and clear d right that i have written now now after writing that what is in the top of it top of it is clear d this is in top of it should clear d is there see the initial state so if you see the initial state d is not clear why because top of d there is c right so c is not clear so this one is unsatisfied again go to the second condition if top is single unsatisfied goal then what we have to do again again we have to remove it and put the action so what action will put uh, in the clear so to clear this what we have to do to clear this we have to unstack what we have to unstack if we want to clear d so we have to unstack it then only d will be clear right so we have to do unstack here so unstack is your r3 sorry rule 4 this is rule 4 okay this one is rule 4 so i am writing rule 4 here unstack unstack what unstack we have to do c comma d we have to unstack it right c comma d we have to unstack then only this d will be clear what is the precondition of unstack here is the first condition is arm should be empty second condition is on c comma d and the third condition is clear c right see here i am i'm just writing uh, by x and y now here i have cleared it so here also we have to clear it in the stack so i'll i'll just what i'll do is i'll just erase it so here i'll just erase it and again i'll write instead of clear i'll write action and the preconditions so the the action i'll write here what is the action here is unstack unstack c comma d arm should be empty next is c should be top of d C should be top of D and C should be clear. Right, C should be clear. So this is my, uh, that I have written. Now what is in the top? Top is again clear C. So is C is clear. So if you'll see this, C is clear or not, you can see with the help of this particular diagram, initial uh, state. So in the initial state, top of c there is nothing right so it means c is clear so that condition is satisfied here now this condition is satisfied right so if the condition is satisfied so what we have to do we just have to pop pop means we just have to remove it because this condition is satisfied the first rule here if you'll see if the top is compound goal then pop it 
because clear C is already there in the initial state, so we just pop it. Okay. So to popping it, what we have to do is we just have to remove it, right? We just have to remove it. So we have just removed it. The second, what is the in the top right now? In the top is on C comma D. It means that C is top of D. Yes, this condition is also satisfied here. In the initial C it is written on C comma D. Yes, it is there. So what we have to do? We have to go for the first condition. This is the first condition. And what is this first condition says that if the top is compound goal, then pop it. So we have to pop it again. So we just have to pop it. Means we just have to remove it. So go to the stack and try to remove it. Okay, now that's done. Now the next one is arm empty. Arm empty means we have seen in the uh, we have seen that there should be an arm. An arm means there should be a robotic arm. So let me draw a robotic arm here. So this robotic arm is uh, the part of this particular example in which that arm is used to uh, used to hold any of the stack. Okay, so you can see that initially arm is empty. So this condition is also satisfied. Which one? Arm is empty. So the arm is empty is also satisfying here, right? So what we do is we just go and clear the top of the stack means we have to pop it because it is satisfied the arm is empty right now now after that what is in the top of the stack is unstack c comma d it is a function right the unstack c comma d is a function and it says that if top is fun is action or any function so what we have to do is pop it and perform the action so if it is an action because unstack is an action is r4 r1 r2 r3 r4 all those are actions so because unstack is an action so what we do we just pop it and perform the action so where is unstack unstack is here you can see this is my first action that could be performed here this is my first action so i am writing here it is a first and here i just remove it from the top of the stack and I'll perform the action. Where I'll perform the action? Definitely in the uh, in the state. So this is my state. Now, after applying the action, what is my state is, let's say I'm applying the action first here. This is my first action. I'll apply here. What is the action that we apply is unstack. Unstack means, let's see, this is B. This is A, this is D, I have an arm. This arm is going to hold C. So this is unstack. Unstack means C has been removed from D, but C is hold by the arm. C is hold by the arm. So this is my, after doing the first condition, this is how my uh, state will look like okay. This is my intermediate state. This is the initial state. This is the intermediate state Now what is in the top of the stack top of the stack? It says holding B So who is holding B arm is holding B? So here if you'll see is arm is holding B no arm is holding C actually arm is not holding B So it is satisfied. No, it is not satisfied. So what we have to do we have to pop it and we have to put the actions. What we have to do, we have to pop it and we have to put the actions and the preconditions for it. So for holding it, what we have to do is we have to pick up. For holding anything, we, we should have pick up, right? So this holding, because this holding is not satisfying here, because we are holding C, we are not holding B. So that's why we just have to 